hope this bridge certainly isn't termites holding hands. This is the nicest looking covered bridge I've ever seen at night. And Chris, you're following me. Ogre's Bridge. Chris, you got the light? Oh yeah. Alright. Actually, let's look off the side first. See the river down there. Okay, yeah. let's walk through. Chris, this is spookier at night. Headless Horseman? I'm getting scared. Headless Horseman, Chris? Might be. Ichabod Crane. Okay. Here, take the light. Shine it. I, I can't see. Just put it down. Get a light foot. Switch it on. Through. Chris, there's a little cutout over here. It's the river down there. You can't see it too bright. Alright, let's continue our walk through it. Yes, this definitely has a different atmosphere at night, doesn't it? Yeah, it wasn't this creepy in the daytime. Chris, get that light out of my eyeball. <laughs> definitely a different atmosphere at night. It's a little creepy. Mass is God. And this bridge, there is traffic. So we gotta be careful. And here comes a car now. Alright, Chris, hurry up. Well, we gotta go through here semi quick because. This is a heavily used bridge. And this bridge is pretty spooky too at night. Remember. This looks like the bridges of Madison County. In that case, just leave me here. Maybe a handsome man will come and rescue me. Clint Eastwood's about 100 years old, Mom. In that case, let's just keep going. All right, let's get our butts through here. 
Uh, you know what? You can hear the river. It sounds so nice at night through here. All right, almost through. Now is this spectacular? They still have all the Christmas stuff up and all the lights through this whole park. And that's where Covered Bridge. And we just drove through it. Now we're gonna walk through it. Look at that. Gorgeous. Isn't this beautiful? Bilges, bilges, bilges! Chris, we're not going through this bridge. <laughs> it's too well made. This is the nicest looking covered bridge at night I've ever seen, and Chris, you're following me. <laughs> <laughs> And look at the park. Now we've been on here. We've been to all these covered bridges, but not at night. And this is a walking path. And the walking path starts right down here. We won't walk down the whole thing because it's at night, but let's just walk a little ways in and see the lights. Beelgeous, Beelgeous, Beelgeous. Christopher, cut that out.
This is Rex Covered Bridge. Rex Covered Bridge, Chris. Yeah. All right, Chris, this is a, a car ridden bridge, so we gotta walk quick. And I see car lights, so let's walk on the side, Chris. Well, he didn't come in here, Chris. This bridge makes a lot of squeaks. Mail, Mr. Farmer. Chris, have some faith in the workmanship of our forefathers. This is the darkest bridge, I think, of them all. This whole area is really dark. Chris, light in front of me, please. Ooh, do you hear all that sounds this bridge makes? A lot of creaks. Listen. I think Chris is right. This might be termites holding hands. That makes a lot of squeaks when cars go over it. The most squeaks I've ever heard on a covered bridge when cars go over it. Well, I think we tempted fate enough. Let's get back in the car and go to the next one. Right up there it says Geiger's Covered Bridge. And cars can go through this one too, so we kind of got to be careful. But this one doesn't make that much noise when we walk through it. Not like Rex's Covered Bridge. And if you look up there, you can see dowels, like these dowels that go through. All of them. Yeah, this one's a nice peaceful bridge walking through. It's definitely not like the last one. And you can hear the river going through all these bridges. Underneath them, really going under them and you can see the river a little bit out there or maybe you can't but we'll walk back through and this one was recently painted maybe a year or so ago and the last time we came here and did this bridge in the day you could still smell the paint though I don't smell it right now This bridge doesn't seem as spooky, Chris, does it? Nope. But this bridge is located right inside, pretty much, Trexler Game Preserve. And the Lehigh Valley Zoo is right here, too. There's a last look at it. Not a lot of traffic going through this one tonight. So let's move on to the next one. 
and you probably won't be able to see it, but there are trails all through and all around this covered bridge. A lot of nice trails. We're not even going to try, I don't think, to walk on this bridge because there are so many cars. I don't know how to pronounce this bridge. Slikers, Slickers, ah, I'll just call it Slippers Bridge. <laughs> Chris, don't sweat this small stuff. I'll put yeah. it on this green. <laughs> we just drove through it a few times for you. So this is as far as we're going to go. And you can watch this other car go through. It's just extremely busy right now here. Fryersville Covered Bridge. Right behind me. Alright, let's walk through there. And they have their Christmas lights up still. Alright. Excuse me, Claire. And this is another peaceful bridge. And you can hear the creek. And this is the plaque. What a beautiful house decorated, huh, Chris? Yeah. The lights out right there, but nice house, nice decorations, beautiful place to live. And right down there's the farm. Oh, actually, it's a creek way over there, way over there. But this light is not very bright. I know one thing, we need a better light. And this is only a pedestrian bridge, so we don't have to fear being run over by a car. Maybe mugged, but not run over by a car. And this is the only covered bridge that's in Northampton County. And it's a doozy. And they have a lonesome Christmas tree right there. And it's a little park. We've been here too. And it goes right where this light is. It goes around a big round circle and comes right back around by the Christmas tree. And on the right side of the bridge, there's also another little walking path. And it goes way down there by the road where you see those tail lights. So one last look at Crydersville Covered Bridge. 
And it's beautiful, isn't it? Especially at night. And while we're here, at this bridge, since it's not real busy, just go down and take a look at the river. And you could probably hear it. Hope nobody's doing any stealth camping here under this bridge, and I guess not. Very nice.